question is about artificial intelligence. According to the newspapers and the developing technology, newspaper and technology, the artificial intelligence will take part of people in some days. This brand new, this recent brand new launching project is like the is as similar as the twice size words. It would be a holocaust. It would be a holocaust catastrophe or a beneficial useful things. And this, this, the artificial intelligence is like the water. It could run through the boat and also could flip it over. And here's the pros and cons for the artificial intelligence. In recent years, Artificial intelligence becomes more and more popular. And today I want to introduce two advantages of AI for you. First, artificial intelligence can be used in many ways. And one of these is factory combined artificial intelligence with robotic arms because a factory can use it to do many things because it's easier to control it control them than employees and it can it can work all the time until it's broken. What's more? The AI robotic arms have has has less error rate. However, the most important of all is factory keep can use it to reduce the production cost and labor labor cost to get more profits. Second, in Taiwan, artificial intelligence can be used to work in nuclear power plants. And it can find some problems which people can't find. It's very important because if there is any crack on the wall, the radioactive material barrier would be discharged into air and water. It's very dangerous and harmful to human health. We strap it development of artificial intelligence. Robot can be robot can be created by human. However, there are some negative side about robots. First, robot have robot have higher productivity than human do. And they can work 24 hours without rest. So many factories use robots to replace human in order to elevate their production and saving labor costs. There are 
careful. Um, employment rate is gradually increasing. Second, people use start using robots to do everything. So let do not figure out the method when dealing with the power. So people become less competitive than robot and well and well and well and always losing their ability to to handle things. Finally, business owners may get more profit with robot and unemployed personnel cannot improve their economy and their economic ability is worse than before. This lead to the widening of a gap between the rich and the poor. Curiosity is a more science laboratory. This kind of AI can detect in unknown areas of humanity. In 2015, Curiosity found soil on Mars is rich in water, but it is not liquid, it's just a mass of vapor. Curiosity also found some organic material can nourish life. It proves that Mars environment has turned can nourish life billions of years ago. Today, Curiosity is still work carrying out a mission on Mars. Robia is a Japanese care robot. This kind of robot can assist him in care work. It's used to moving patients from the bed to the wheelchair and helping people who is unable to move freely. Because of manpower shortage, this new technology can help care a lot. Robert can talk with people and provide a system of housework. This kind of robot is a future trend. Science and technology is improving day by day, and it brings us a lot of convenience. But no one is perfect, even a robot. Human can make a robot, but robot can make a human. In recent years, a lot of countries is researching the medical artificial intelligence robot, and it uses exact other grants to an analyze and find a feature to predict the result. Even the homework sometimes not, so do the robot. A robot. If the if the AI robot make a wrong decision and kill somebody who could steal her life. It's very serious. It's medical negligence. And it makes a lot another problem. The air the medical AI robot need our personal information to cure us. If the hacker head into the robot systems, 
it may put everybody in danger. Now it's Internet of Things generation. You can find anything you want on the net. If our personal information spread on the net, and we will not have any any privacy. And these two is two are artificial intelligence robot. The white one is Pepper, and the other one is Sophia. Sophia is the most AI robot in most beautiful AI robot in the world, and she is the first robot got the nationality in Saudi Arabia. She is. She is she's getting smart and smart and she can answer some questions. And one re interview, the host asked Sophia, did we need to worry about the robot? She said, if you good to me and I will good to good to you. So the technology improvement is good, but we still learn how to live with robot peacefully. And also, there has a this there has a disadvantage. The movie, the movie that directed by James Cameron, the Termin Terminator series, was an it, it shows the it shows a disaster led by the Skynet. The Skynet in the film is an is an ultra ultra computer system that exploited by the U.S. government for national defense. But the but the ro originally but the robot came from the future. It generates the self-intelligence. So it recognizes the people, it recognizes human to the, to the, to the species of threatening men. So setting so setting people to the destroy mode. So setting people in a destroy mode and cause a lot of lot, cause many problems. And so the conclusion is we should balance the library between human and robots. Our presentation is end. Thank you for listening. Okay guys, I'll see you tomorrow morning, you can go.